in a relationship you need to learn to forgive you need to learn to forgive because god forgives and that is exactly what colossians 3 13 talks about you need to learn to forgive because god forgives us like the saying goes to err is human and to forgive is divine Hey guys welcome back to our channel my name is Z.Y. Harrison and I'm a Lagos based YouTuber if you're a new subscriber here please hit the subscribe button down below and if you're a returning subscriber what's good thank you so much for coming back to our channel in one of my previous video I did um, five things that are very very important in a relationship and I said um, if the video did well I was going to do a part two the video didn't do as much as I wanted it to um, but it did quite well it was okay um and i decided to do a part two anyway because i feel like what's part one without a part two all right so that's why i decided to do a part two like i said in the previous video there are so many things that are very very important in a relationship the few ones i'm listing are not the only ones that are important in relationship there are so many of them but i just picked out a few of them to discuss with you guys and um, also to let you guys in on what are most important or what are important if you didn't know before these are the things that are really really important in a relationship like i said there are other ones but these ones are very very important to me and i thought to share with you guys so the first one is trust having trust in a relationship signifies longevity it makes your relationship last longer it makes your relationship lead to forever you know that forever you want to get to because i'm sure you want to marry the love of your life the person you're with at the moment if you're not ready to settle down with the person you're with at the moment please leave there's no point of wasting your time in that relationship but everybody needs trust in their relationship that signifies longevity it signifies permanence however if you lack this ingredient in your relationship i'm not sure that the relationship is healthy neither is it secure because you're always going to be insecure about your relationship you're going to have insecurity and that would not help that relationship at all trust can be built with time and that's if you both are ready to work together in it if one person trusts the other person and the other person doesn't trust that person there's always going to be issues and trust me that relationship is never going to last that relationship is going anywhere if one person is the only one trusting of the other person in the relationship that make your love life exciting and fulfilling if the ingredient of trust is missing so if you're having trust issues today talk to your partner on why you're having trust issues you guys should work on it and make sure that trust is in your relationship trust is very very important so make it one of the ingredients in your relationship today the next one on my list is respecting each other respecting one another in as much as this sounds cliche disrespecting one another can actually fade your relationship do not think because love is enough there's nothing that can affect your relationship if you do not respect your partner and your partner does not respect you trust me that relationship isn't going to work it is going to make the love fade fast love cannot be a justification of sacrificing your self-worth or disrespecting your partner you guys need to understand what your partner would like and what your partner would not like you guys need to understand your differences you know in as much as they say see finish is not good yes it is not good it is not good so to avoid see finish you need to respect your partner you need to respect his boundaries you need to respect her boundaries you need to know that if you do some certain things your partner is not going to be excited about it your partner is not going to be happy about it so you have to learn to respect your partner once you learn how to respect your partner things are going to be more relatable and you'll be able to understand things better disrespecting one another only causes more of resentment and at the end of the day you will not even know how to leave your relationship because the relationship will become very toxic for you and by then it might have been too late because you guys would have been married or and you guys wouldn't want to go through divorce and all that so learn to respect your partner and you as well whatever it is you want in your partner be that person for your partner if you want respect for your partner make sure you respect your partner as well so that your partner can also show you some form of respect the third one on my list is loyalty being unloyal in your relationship is very very detrimental to the kind of relationship loyalty helps with the longevity of your relationship and anybody that has loyalty in their relationship that relationship is a very sacred one <clears throat> if you want to make your relationship work then you need to be very very committed to your partner you need to be extremely loyal to your partner you need to learn not to cheat because these days majority of people that are in relationship have other side partners you know the saying of 
side chick like a lot of people have side chicks these days i don't know what the um what the men are called the men that are dating a girl that is in another relationship are they called side men what are they called but i know that there are so many side chicks these days like you're married and you have a side chick it means you're not loyal to your partner what other thing are you going to bring to your partner that also brings us back to disrespecting your partner and there are so many health disadvantages to being unloyal to your partner you might go out and bring whatever it is that she do not even ask you to bring home and you bring it home to her she starts suffering for it so try to be loyal to your partner today so that you do not even have a cause to worry a relationship most time feels when you have a third party in the mix when you're already bringing another person into it it makes your relationship easily fade it makes the love in your relationship easily die so um if you've not been loyal to your partner before this is a sign that you should be loyal now loyalty is one of the best ingredients of a relationship you know that this person is for you and you're for this person you're loyal to this person come rain come shine it's going to be you and this person that's what loyalty is about all right the fourth one is being a team there's this exciting feeling about being a team like you know that you and your partner are in the same team nobody is in team a and nobody is in team b you are both in team a in as much as every relationship or every individual in a relationship needs personal space a relationship requires you to wear different hats at different times sometimes you have to be at the listening end you have to listen to your partner so that you can give the best support you know your partner requires at that moment maybe your partner is having issues at work you have to patiently listen to your partner while your partner expresses yourself to you and you have to know what to tell your partner to make sure that your partner is calm you have to be on the same team not that your partner is sad and is having issues at work and you you are the you are the troublemaker he comes back and you're already shouting and yelling not knowing that he's going through a lot at work you know you have to be a support system for your partner you have to be your partner's cheerleader you have to be your partner's teammate you guys have to be teammates together your combined strength compensates for each other's weakness when you guys are a team it helps make things easy when somebody is going through something the other person is there to support the person when somebody is down another person is there to lift you up that is what um being there for each other means that is what being a team means you guys need to be a team agree to disagree the last one on my list is forgiveness i saved the best for the last right forgiveness is a very very important virtue and everybody needs to learn how to forgive and that is exactly what colossians 3 13 talks about you need to learn to forgive because god forgives us and who are we as humans not to forgive whenever we do something we always run back to god to forgive us and if god can forgive us as human we should also learn to forgive we should also learn to work out our differences and um, have an understanding of forgiveness like the saying goes to err is human and to forgive is divine if your partner makes a mistake and, and is sincere about your mistake and the person is ready to do things differently there's nothing wrong with you communicating with that person and also making the person understand that you have forgiven them as far as the person is ready to make amends or whatever it is they've done and is ready to do things differently there's no reason why you shouldn't forgive the person although there are some mistakes that would definitely affect your relationship that would definitely have an impact on your relationship but i feel like having an understanding of forgiveness will actually help you understand the person if you're in a relationship you need to learn to forgive you need to learn to forgive because god forgives you need to learn to understand your partner when your partner makes a mistake understand why the person made that particular mistake or why the person did whatever it is they did have an understanding of communication and learn to have an open mind so that it will be easy for you to forgive the person god forgives us so who are we as human not to forgive our partners all right all right guys we've come to the end of this video those are five important things in your relationship five things you need to know that are very very important in your relationship and i hope that you guys enjoyed this video um if you did please give this video a huge thumbs up drop a comment if you've not subscribed please subscribe already thank you guys so much for watching this video i'm gonna see you guys in my next video bye